We'll see you again. God bless. Welcome to the Pacific Business Hub. Yeah, and it's cold. raining. But, it, but we've got the warmth of friendship. 
We do. <laughs> on the table. <laughs> it's all about the vibes, the good, good mm. vibes for your Monday. And before we get into the whole thanking our sponsors, mm. we thought that we would share a little bit of a Monday motivational mm. quote that we decided that we would share today for your Monday. Um, this is, and I actually really, really like this one. I really, really love this yeah. one. And the quote for your Monday today is, "Never seek revenge." Rotten fruit will fall by itself. Yep. Very wise words. Very wise words from mm -hmm. um, the Manukau Fruit Centre here <laughs> at uh, the Pacific Business Hub. So what we're <laughs> it's good advice for, you know, you might have had bad interaction with yep. someone over the weekend. Yeah. Um, maybe a friend did something bad or... Or sent a bad message mm, or, you know, bad or vibes. Or memory popped up from your phone. You're, You're like, oh... oh. Two years ago, no. Don't worry about no. it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Smile. You know, um, yeah. because that rotten fruit will honestly fall off by itself. There's no need to seek revenge because mm. you know what? T seeking revenge just takes up too much energy. A lot of thinking and a lot of energy straining over some things that... That is not even... Mm worth your time so again never seek mm. revenge rotten fruit will fall by itself just yes. surround yourself with positive people because you know what that's what we need that's, that's what true. we need every monday um and then today we thought what 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 normally mm. you know it's common for us to really dislike monday mm. i'm not going to use the h word the H word, that heavy H word. I'm what's gonna the say H word. Dis <laughs> what's the H word, Claudia? I'm just gonna use um, dislike because um, you know the H word is quite heavy, so you know yes. I'm not gonna use it. But because you know, it's following two days of freedom, mm -hmm. then you kind of find yourself kind of down on the dumps. No, don't be down on the dumps on a Monday. No. Pick yourself up and make sure that you are well organized. Um, you know, think of the goals that you have in mind for the week, and I think um, do a to-do list. Yep. Do a to-do yes. list. Um, it's and so satisfying when you can tick something off yep. or like cross it off your to-do list. Yeah. Like, yes. yes, done it. Um, have create a Monday ritual. So, you know, I think this morning um, I shared a quote about your soulmate. And you know, it's it is a special you know soulmate that you need in your life that picks you up every morning, that motivates you, that drives you, that shows that same passion and energy for you every morning. So a shout out and a, and a massive love out going out to you know if you've got a soulmate, man, great because don't let them go, man. I'm telling you, massive regrets, <laughs> yeah. massive regrets. But um, another good one is wear a feel good outfit. Yep. And sh That's always, true. always, always show kindness. Yes. That's really great advice there, there. Very great <laughs> advice. You yep. know, and talking about being positive and surrounding yourself with positive people. Shout yep. out to Lessa, yep. who's just commented. Um, Lessa from Zumba Fit last week. We did say that um, Ben and I were going to go to Zumba. Um, on Saturday, and guess what, guys? We did. We did it. We did it. Woman of our own <laughs> word. We got up really early. We were there at the Otara Powerhouse yeah. um, at 9.35, I think. Nine, but we got 9 there. 9.31? Yeah. <laughs> we got there. We did an hour worth of Zumba, and it was amazing. It um, was. It really we was. We didn't know the moves. We were really unfit. Yeah. But we smashed it out. We had <laughs> so much fun. <laughs> so... Five and it's only five dollars, and mm. I swear it was actually really, you know. And I, I was saying to Lisa over the weekend, you know, um, with what's going on in life and mm. so much, you know, that you're battling daily, it was actually so good to 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 walk into a place, not not be judged um, for what you're wearing, yeah. for how you look, and yeah. you just went in there. And I said, I think there was one stage um, where, I think it was Celine Dion, they were playing like winding down. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They played Celine Dion, one of her iconic, um, you know, songs. <laughs> and, and you know, and I felt myself. Dream. Yeah, it was Jack and, um, and. And Rose. No, Jack and Rose, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I could just feel myself kind of like, my soul kind of like, <laughs> out of my body and thinking what the heck my and just that tear just falling down my face like i did it I oh, really we did actually it. did it, it was, was hard guys it was, hard, like, but it was good 
And it was so great because there was like a little area of, um, with, you know, couches yep. and, you know, the little babies and toddlers were there. You yep. had some mums there just chilling now. There were like heaps of kids. Yeah. Um, there was so much just cheering on. I loved it so much. Oh, I, I, I loved it. I loved it. I and absolutely. I felt so good for the rest of the day. I did. And it was like a massive tick that I got up really early. I had a um, homemade breakfast. Went to Zumba, went back home, and I did my, all my laundry, yeah. cleaned my room, domestic goddess. Domestic <laughs> it was pretty domestic. good. Like, you know, and, and lesser, lesser, oh my gosh, mm. the energy, the vibe was just incredible. We've just got some, we've got a few photos that we're going to share, just proof yes. that, that <laughs> myself were there. and Claudia were there <laughs> um, to support our local community and the initiatives that they're putting forward for um, Otara. So um, a massive, massive shout out to Alessa and the team there at um, Powerhouse. It's not easy putting uh, these types of events on for the community. Um, and it's not cheap either. So a massive, massive shout out um, uh, to Alessa. So yeah. no, I actually really enjoyed um, myself over the weekend. So we're looking forward to Round two this Saturday morning. <laughs> <laughs> Round two, yes, we are doing a, a little bit of a fitness journey, um, myself and Claudia, mm. just to, you know, we can't promote um, the health business no. and you the health story. talk the talk if you're not going to walk, walk the, the walk. walk. And right. last Saturday we took that first step, so <laughs> we're walking the walk, guys. Yeah, and well, because the night before we were actually celebrating, um, if you did tune in last week on Friday, we did cut the show short. It was a massive cross there. Um, we had Tui, uh, the ET Live team, um, breaking, breaking news. news. Breaking um, so news, guys. Congratulations uh, to the very first um, female Prime Minister of the Pacific, um, Fia Me. So, That's oh, that was huge. Older, yeah. We have the first ever female <laughs> Prime Minister in Pacific. And the. the That's the, the, <laughs> It's massive. That's monumental, it's, guys. It is. It's, a, it's mind-blowing, um, especially for, um, you know, myself mm. uh, being a Samoan female uh, woman. It has been quite difficult and challenging mm. at times um, to voice yeah. um, our opinions as a woman. Mm. It's, it's, you know, and it's, it's not easy. Yeah. Um, you know, I think with uh, previous shows, we've discussed um, a little bit about um, how it does affect kind of, you know, that role yeah. and how that comes into play. But, you know, without going into too much detail about it, you know, it's just a massive congratulations. Yeah. You know, I think everyone's Thanks. seen the media and um, Jacinda Ardern has um, sent her um, message yes. of congratulations through. So, yeah, that was um, awesome. And just talking about strong mm. women empowering other women, um, Lisa has said, you guys, as in Fair and myself, are doing your own track when we're ready. <laughs> We gotta learn and apply, apparently. <laughs> so, learn and apply. All right, challenge accepted. But we might just need a little bit more practice to get to know um, the moves more. <laughs> yeah. Um. Look, we're gonna go straight into a quick little break. Mm. Uh, we will be we will be talking a little bit about what the do's sorry the do's and the don'ts mm. when it comes to working. Um. You know, what do you wear? Yep. Um, As a female, what is appropriate? work mm. attire and what is the big deal anyway yes. right and is it fair to judge a woman on what she wears mm. and how is much it? skin she shows let because us know in your comments because comment below on what you think mm. and what your thoughts are um, mm. with regards to this topic about mm. you know what you wear does it make you less intelligent and all this kind mm. of bs and you already know what i'm talking about what the <laughs> bs that i'm talking about so yes. comment below and, and um share mm. your thoughts with us because we'll be talking about it yeah. right after the break a massive massive fafite lover to our major sponsors mm. as well um of course pacific easy pacific 40 uh Maoto samoa mm. seki work say oriana and of course, the beautiful Laura here at the Pacific Business Hub. That's it. Um, we're going to go into a quick break because I think we need to gather our thoughts because this hot topic coming right after the break. What are the do's? And anyway, is it your business anyway? Yeah. <laughs> is it? Really? You let us know. Let us know, guys. Comment below right after the break.
Welcome to the Pacific Business Hub.
one of Ilo Fatau. Il est tout le temps à Maïl Talo for that shop. Il est one of Akao, ma mère de Manga Oye. Il est le vent shop. Talofa Lava and welcome back everyone. We are here with our friend Asiata who's got her show <laughs> from 5 to 6. So remember to not go anywhere and stay tuned for her show. Mm. And just before we went on break, we see we're going to talk a little bit about what is appropriate female work attire. Yep. And does the length of a woman's skirt <laughs> reflect her intelligence? And I think Bear wants to say a little something now that she's got you know, her glasses And, and, and I'm going to make a, a little bit of a statement as well. Like, when I wear, you know, the glasses, because mm. I know that, you know, when you're watching movies and, um, you know, when you attend the schools and, and the kids used to get mocked, oh, such a geek. And geek, <laughs> me, was a translation for brainy. So am I brainy now that I've got glasses on? Mm. I'm uh, just, you know, I know that everyone's like, know, like, everyone's like, uh, no, like a, there they look, look like, like safety glasses. You look, like <laughs> <laughs> you look more like a plumber to me. Right? Hey, hey, there's nothing wrong with a plumber, eh? Because we need plumbers. Plumbers. I are never said anything plumbers. wrong with plumbers. Plumbers are quite smart, though. Yeah. Oh, they are. No, they're, 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 and, they're and some of them are quite attractive too, you know. Probably oh, <laughs> plumbers. Oh. Plumberers, do you know? <laughs> well, there's quite a few, but I'm just saying, like, do I, am I, am I more intelligent yeah. now that I've got glasses on? Yeah. Now, uh, you do look like uh, somebody that's spent a lot of time in front of a computer, you know, that, yeah. um, a PlayStation as well. <laughs> <laughs> or, or, or do I look like, or, <laughs> or the question is, do I look like someone that's on um, site, you know, on the site saying, stop. Uh, yep, this car come through. You know, oh, you know, like you know, one. safety oh, glasses. Oh, yeah, oh, the PPIs, the hard, uh, you know. Oh. You know, the hard hat, you know. The nah, you, nah, I do definitely you actually like... look attractive now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the power of safety the power glasses. Of safety glasses. <laughs> right. Staying safe, guys. Wow, now that, that you look beautiful, oh, whether you, with you. or without our glasses, oh, you still look beautiful, you. Uh, Pia. Yeah. Um, it's so great to have you on the show, Asiata, because we're yes. actually going to talk about, you know, um, is it appropriate that females are judged based on what they wear? Well, first of all, I wish I can wear what you guys are wearing, because looking at what I'm wearing, it does look like in the back of the 70s. And <laughs> 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 but, but, hey, it's tradition. By the way, uh, I, I, I think, you know, I, I wouldn't I wouldn't judge anyone by the way they mm. dress. Mm -hmm. And mainly nowadays with whatever professions that you mm. um, choose to, to, to become. Uh, in some point, some uh, employers mm. do have dress codes. Mm. Yep. So obviously that makes it a lot easier. But with, in terms of, I'll, I'll reference back to what, what the, 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 the rumours that was, you know, came from Samoa from last week in yeah. terms of what the former Prime Minister was saying. <laughs> I promise not political, but it's just <laughs> reference to that. Hey, I, I, th I found it. I found it was quite ridiculous, to be honest. Mm. You know, I, I kept on. She, the, the lawyer that he was referring to, if if I guess it correct, mm. uh, she was one of the person that I look up to. Mm. You know, even the way she dressed. Mm. Yeah. I mean, I would love for you, our our, our sisters, our modern, our, our our ladies, to dress up. I mean, come on, it's mm. a modern days. Mm. Mm. I mean, we want them. Even even you know, below knees, above knees. As long as it's not bikinis, you know, and then and, and the wrong, uh, yeah. <laughs> you know, okay. I mean. bikini for the beach, but absolutely, oh yeah, absolutely. So, but like, because we we all we've all seen that photo, yeah. right? And her skirt is below her knees, mm. and to be honest, I would consider that a very conservative skirt. Yeah. Um, excellent for work, excellent for mm. um, events, excellent all all the way around. So. Absolutely, and and it suits her profession yeah. as a lawyer. Yeah. Mm. I mean, we wouldn't want to see lawyers with 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 a mu -mu or, or a long dress all I mean, the way. I, I, to I mean, to be honest, I, I don't I don't think it matters, you know, what they're in. To be honest, I mean, like obviously, I, you wouldn't expect them to wear a bikini, right? No. Yeah. But, but, I think if um, I think a woman can make a choice whether she does or not. So, yeah. I'm, I'm just putting it out there because I think sometimes, you know, and I feel that, you know. Um, and I'm going to make this comment, and I'm, I know that it's going to offend a few people. It's not our fault mm. that you have these yeah. thoughts that 
sometimes and and i'm and my, my the dress that i'm wearing today is above my knee so um if you have Make a sure you don't stand up please <laughs> oh, <okay. laughs> it, is, it is above my knees and I'm yeah. not saying you know and and I, I do as a Samoan uh, female I have from time to time had to rethink what I wear mm. not because I wanted to rethink it because of me mm. I had to rethink what I had to wear or what I'm wearing because of what another Samoan person is or you know another person is going to think mm -hmm. and I'm going to say our people I'm sorry mm. Um, mm. because it, it's Basically, yeah. I think I think it comes to the applications of 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 a uh, dress in such an occasion, mm. right? Because in our Fasamoan culture, mm. we do have appropriate dress yeah. for mm. an appropriate occasions. Yeah. For example, uh, weddings, you know, a funerals, mm. yeah. you know, because the uh, the beauty of the Fasamoan is performing right there, mm -hmm. right? So, but bringing that sort of perspective into a work-related relate, mm, issues, mm, I don't mm. think it's right. Yeah. yeah. I mean, because the first time work cannot control the court mm -hmm. uh, and, and the dress code in yeah. there. I mean, we can make opinions about it, yeah. but obviously that doesn't change anything mm. right there because uh, the court and the judiciary have their own policies. Mm. I mean, for God's sake, how many weeks and now, months now since uh, mm. that lawyer has been walking in and out and then now and all of a sudden they make a, towards the very end of yeah. the three months? Yeah. But I think that, that whole the, the, the judgment on the fact that, um, you know, a, a woman is less, you know, you know, a, a, her intelligence, like based on what she's the wearing, the skirt. length of the skirt. Yeah. I'm just quite... It's nah. It's that. That's ridiculous mm. to me. I don't. Mm. I I decreded and discredited mm. or whatever the word suits for that. I I stand up for mm. not agreeing mm. with yeah. that sort and of. That's why um, I wore the, this. I thought decide. No, I'll just wear some glasses because, yeah. um, growing up, I thought okay, when you wear. <laughs> if this is me growing up, you know. Oh yeah, if you wear glasses, you're um, smart. You're smart. Yeah. And one thing, one thing that makes me proud of with the effort that nowadays. A lot of females lawyers mm. in Samoa because I grew up in Samoa, mm. and when I was you know back, I'm talking about 30 years mm. ago, all I've seen in Samoa are male lawyers, male lawyers like male dominance of mm. this mm -hmm. um, uh, section, you know, of lawyer judiciary. So it's it's sort of like a male dominance. Yeah. Mm. Now we've seen you know Brenda Latu mm -hmm. and um, uh, Muriel and all these, uh, mm -hmm. for, you know, a lot of them. And yeah. it makes me so happy, yeah, you know, so that, that we woman. finally yeah. get Definitely. to be 50-50. Mm -hmm. And I would love to, 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 to agree with the percentage of female being raised mm -hmm. up yeah. in parliament as well. Yeah. No, I, I, I agree, man. I, and I absolutely. And, I'm, and, and I'm, no, I'm not a feminist, but I'm just, you know, it just about to be No, like, I'm not a feminist either. But yeah. like, I think it is um, a CEO of Pepsi once said that it's a lot harder for women to actually succeed in their careers because their biological clock and mm. their career mm -hmm. line are always clashing each other. Like you either sacrifice your biological clock and have kids at a later date so mm. you can focus on career yeah. or you have kids early and then sacrifice that time mm. and then focus on your career afterwards. So it's a lot harder for a woman to already get on that career la mm. ladder. So then to be judged on just an outfit. And I mean, like, I'm going to, like challenge this question to everyone. If what she wore was inappropriate, what is considered appropriate then? Yeah. Because her skirt was below her knee, she mm. had her blouse, she was mm. covering her arms. What is appropriate then? I think the, the most inappropriate thing there was the media that took the photo. <laughs> 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 I mean, what was your mind? I mean, I know, like you, capturing. Like, oh my gosh, it's only like I, I actually only see... really liked your outfit. Yeah, I, know, I, I know. I thought it was for like, oh my god, you know, really good. Stuff I, I, you know, so this is and this is another, and I'm actually going <laughs> off topic as well. But again, you know, and then and then we get told out, and 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 I'm not saying all men. I'm not, in case someone goes, ah, oh, she said all men. I didn't say all yeah, men. Yeah. Um, you know, you find that nowadays mm. men kind of want them their partners or females to to look you know good absolutely you know, so that you know uh, absolutely because so they're a reflection of you your partner's an extension yeah. of you well, but right. put it put it this way because because i'm a, i'm a male i'm a man Samoan, born, born mm -hmm. raised in Samoan now 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 in new zealand i mean exactly not to tell you the truth to be honest i wouldn't want i wouldn't want to you know my 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 wife mm. To um, sort of like lacking off with her style yeah. towards this, you know, the now modernization yeah, yeah, world, yeah. if that makes sense. You know, I wouldn't want her to just, I mean, if I walk 
with her in shopping centers. I mean, I love the best for my for my wife. Mm -hmm. You know, whatever the latest fashion, whatever the latest, the latest uh, you know, yeah, you know, yeah. style. Yeah. You know, I love her too. Yeah. Well, only if I could afford it. But, yeah. <laughs> but you know what I mean. Um, yes, we we do agree, yeah. and and it's an older mentality of Samoa. Mm. Uh, when after the, you know you have your wife, and then the wife sort of like, I don't worry, but you are here. Mm. You know, so that as as long as you look after the kids. I mean, Connor, those days, mate. Yeah. Come on, yeah. wake up. Everyone's you know. Like it's, one of my cousin's wife. She said, um, before they got married, she was like, the way I looked is what attracted my husband yep. to me. So once we get married, I'm not going to change the way mm. I dress. So Because they actually had an argument once and they were like, oh, you need to wear like really long skirts and like t-shirts up to here. She's like, no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm not going to wear that because you're still going to be looking at other girls that are wearing the short skirts. Yeah, that, well, that's it. And, 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 and there you go. And there so you go. So why should I cover up yep. for you? And, and that's where, and that's that problem comes in. Mm, that's yeah. where, you know, if, if you, the more you, you're not encouraging your partner, your wife, your yeah. loved ones yeah. to, to dress up, you know, to, mm. and then you, you go up publicly and then you will see, I mean, obviously yeah, your so. eyes, you know, but they are wandering eyes, right? Absolutely. Yeah. And then and then you'll be like in your mind, ah, oh, why is she, you know, mm. and not because of yeah. you. <laughs> you know, you're the one that's looking at me, right? <laughs> it's, but, yeah, and that's true. It's so true. <laughs> Absolutely. And then you turn into this kind of cameraman and then go to a wrong shot like that. <laughs> yeah. But I mean, what are your thoughts? What are, you know, what are your thoughts? Oh, um, if you God. are watching, let us know what you what you know Absolutely. what your thoughts are. And and we're not just talking about work attire. And, and I know that there are um, you know, like Asiata mentioned, yeah, yeah, give me if I you know, and I'm and I'm like like myself. I'm not silly, you know, uh, face here, fat love lovey, you know, for the family. And when elderly's in the home, hey, and yeah. then expecting you to bring a cup of tea, obviously you're not going to rock yeah, up no. with your mini oh, skirt. It's and... self-respect. It's yes. respect yeah. for yourself, respect yeah. for the person you're with. Yeah. And, and yeah. you know, the, the, the whole culture thing. Yeah. That comes into play, 100%. of course. 100%. But, um, uh, you know, and, and that's where that all comes into play. I know that when mm. I go, you know, I, I wear ripped jeans and my mum and dad are not impressed mm. um, that I wear these kind of ripped jeans and everything. Like, oh, oh, you know, love, love, love. You know, and then they're like, yeah, love, love, love. Shout out to Brother Fala, Suna Tiakono, wearing a lava lama and a necktie. <laughs> and, and I do, and I do get judged based on that, and, yeah. and I get told, you know, um, that you know, the the term that's been used is oh, I feel like I feel like blah blah blah, and I get that, but I'm not always necessarily there at whatever event yeah. it is. Mm. So, you know, I'm more comfortable in whatever it is that I'm, yeah. you know, here to work. So I know when I come to work, okay, yeah, I know you dress for the occasion. I dress for oh, the yeah, occasion that's, I that's, what I'm, that's what I'm saying. But yeah. you know. If I choose to wear a, 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 a mini skirt, mm. I will. It's and like, I mean, on Saturday when we went to Zumba, I'm just going to say that again. Yeah. Like, we rolled out of bed, I was in my hoodie, I was in track yeah. pants, you had your hat on. And, like, we wouldn't wear that to the show. No, right? Because every moment has its own appropriate clothing. That, that's what, I'm, that's what mm. I'm saying. You know, you, you dress to the right moment mm. and the right occasions. I, and I think most of our parents do encourage us with that saying, mm. reference to what you're saying as being for the core. And I think most of their mind, <laughs> no, nah, most of their minds are, sorry, are, I should have that up. <laughs> it's, it's, it's preferably or preferably Christianity yeah. with their motivations yeah. of mm. encouragement. Mm, yeah. so when they say, five for the leo, love, love, I tell you, all for the core. They are referring specifically mm. to this Christianity world, mm. you know. I'm pretty sure mum and dad, it's not mean by when you, your workplace, mm. because mm. because obviously they know there are uniforms, mm. there are mm. dress codes. Yeah. But when they say that to us, because I'm pretty sure they, they are specific a situation where that encouragement. Yeah. There, and there, that. there is, and, and I'm, look, and, and I'm, this is, this is where I'm quite, you know, when my mum and dad said, Fia poco, old fia poco. And I do from time to time, I know, you know, mm. um, I, I, I do understand um, what, where they're, where they're. Yeah. but what I'm wearing and, you know, my ripped jeans, it doesn't change um, the way my heart is. Do no. you know what I mean? Oh, absolutely. It does, and, it, mm. and, it, and, and it, I tell you, if I'm wearing a mini skirt to work mm -hmm. or a bikini, I can tell you right now, I will give you the same 110% in whatever outfit I'm in. Yeah. Just saying. Yeah. So those are, that, that, that was for me, I was quite disappointed in that, mm. in the mm. comments that were yeah. made because it um, doesn't matter what I'm wearing, ripped mm. jeans, um, short shorts, um, mini skirt, 
And, and just with, 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 with reference to what, what uh, Mr. Former Prime Minister Tila Ipa, because I, I wanted to say this, I, I don't think he was, he was actually meant to say bikini. <laughs> no, no, honestly, that, that's I just know, me. Yeah, that's know. just me personally. Yeah. I, I think that just out, came out of um, portion. Yeah. Like, you know, mm. I think he was actually referring to mini. <laughs> You know, but then you know how I think he realized he realized that the Mr. Hey, hey I'm not stuck up for this one. But, but I think, but it's because when, I, I think he just realized because hey, I make mistakes sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When he realized, that, I think it was meant to say mini, but then he already realized he was saying bikini, and he yeah. goes oh, <laughs> mini, like yeah, you know. Yeah. I think, I think look, that and, and I, I, I thought I'll just happen. yeah, know, mistakes, yeah happen. mistakes happen. And look, and, so, and I've got nothing um, against um, you know the former prime minister. Yeah. You know, no, he's no. done an amazing, Absolutely. amazing. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, sent you know f all these years mm. in Parliament. No, yeah. today no, was his. You, know, you got to give credit where yeah, it's yeah, like, yes. yes. to him. Yeah. And his comments were, you know, and I do understand that you know the whole you know the Samoa, the Fat Samoa, in the way that you know, like mentioned, you know, appropriate mm. outfits for yeah. certain occasions. But then I just wanted to add that you know I, I think it doesn't matter what we wear, mm. you know, the woman. I think if you have your whole heart in there, one hundred percent, man, I tell you, it doesn't matter what um, woman wear. Yeah. You give mm. her that role, or give that woman whatever she will do yeah. it one hundred and ten percent with yeah. her whole heart. And I think she'll probably do it better than me anyway. <laughs> no, absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> so, so all the women's out there, don't feel you know um, yeah. discredited about what whoever's commenting like that. I think people that make those comments, they, they are actually the ones that, you know, they do have problems with themselves. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. yeah, just do True. what you do best and dress to impress, mm. you know. Uh, suitable for whatever situations. Don't, mm. don't let those comments let you guys, yeah. girls, ladies down. Yeah. If anything, we should be grateful um, that this topic has been mentioned yeah. because people can talk about it now right sometimes mm. people just want to talk about it a we had bit a, I mean, we had a good laugh about it you know and, <laughs> I, did. and I did and I had and I posted up a, um, uh, a status um, on my Facebook page that um, on the day I found out I, said, I, I actually didn't really, I said I think I might wear a bikini to work um, which is uh, something that will never happen right now <laughs> oh, please. Um, but I will maybe <laughs> I think uh, we're all actually quite excited I, for that yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm oh, maybe shall, shall we have a, shall we have a, 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 a bikini, <laughs> bikini <day>? <laughs> A bikini Friday, and um, but you know, uh, but what is what is I'm sorry, but what what is bikini in Samoa? I mean, yeah, true. Because I, I, I only know uh, swim swim suits swimwear. Yeah. swimwear. Ofuka ele, yes, that that's that's Ofuka the first time over it. But then, what, what is bikini. bikini in Samoa? Well, see, the thing yeah, is anyway. maybe because I long because what? Shall we put up that a, a question like that to people and what? then commenting? <laughs> language week, advanced <laughs> language week. <laughs> Oh, a shout out to Flora, um, who's watching. Hi, girl. How are you? Maybe you can tell us how to say a bikini in Samoa. Absolutely. Yeah. How to well, maybe? What, what's a fashion more a proper? Hey, no negative. Yes. <laughs> because I own a yeah, swimwear of swim the mm. ah, Well, you know the other question that I was thinking: Did we? Because I haven't actually seen a, a current, a, the recent Miss Samoa. Mm. Do they have a swimwear? Yeah. Do they have a swimwear? Samoan. Obviously, we, we do have a uh, Samoan. Do they have a swimwear in the, in the pageant? Uh, I actually had to. Yeah. Do they? Flora, yes. if you're watching, yes. do they? Do they? they yeah, they have oh, swimwear. That's when the, the female comes in with a lava lava. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they cap it up, with, actually. With a lava lava, oh, okay, you okay, know, okay. like a crossfit lava yeah. lava neck. <laughs> yeah, so, that's but a oh, just lava so, lava. Okay, so, okay. Yeah, I was imagining like a full-on bikini. I was like, oh, that's very nice. I shouldn't uh, think anyone has Sorry one. about it. <laughs> have, I've, I've worn a bikini before. Uh, I have worn a bikini uh, before I as have. well, yes. Right. I have. I, I, I can, yeah. I can Have you worn portray. a bikini before? <laughs> <laughs> I, I cannot you're, picture. You're in a safe space. I, cannot cannot picture. Picture. You can I, I actually cannot picture, you know, our, our crew. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we can have our boss wearing a bikini. No, but see the mankini. I, I think man he heard. Oh, our <laughs> office heard that. Is it the mankini front of the That's a mankini. Hey, I love lamb bikini. Yeah. If we buy a mankini, we would try you wear it? Not me. Not, not, not me. Not the camera. Lorenzo. Lorenzo, Lorenzo will do that. Bro. Lorenzo will do that. <laughs> there we go. Definitely. We no. can have a little runway. <laughs> Shall we do? Maybe shall we do a, a swimwear fashion? I think. 
Look, um, look, I know, you know, we're laughing, which it is. We're laughing about it. We're joking about it. But let's look, let's just have a look at a, Let's just have comments. a look at some of the commenting. All right, uh, let's just try um, Fasa more for Sui Stowers. Okay, go wash off a picoa or wear a bikini all day. And now, read Jay Hunt. Of my like it's a tie, Elia. Yeah, it's a good one. Of what? Of why like it's a tie, Elia. Hey, that was so good. Oh, well, um, I was so good. Well, okay. So, and um, but in Peru, tell us more. So, so obviously, because as Samoans, yeah. Pacific Islanders, when we, we we talk about bikini, obviously we we mean Palangi way. Yeah, mm. absolutely. So what about in, in Peru, South America? It's the same, a bikini. Like wow. the, the palangi no, but, wear bikini. No, but do you... Do oh, you, the way we say in Spanish. Do you have a... Yeah, do you have, do a, have Spanish? a Spanish word for it? Bikini. bikini. <laughs> like it's really... It is, I know it's really bad, but that's how you say oh, is that, it. Is that, is that what to think of? Like a heavy... Hey, is that what to think of? It's bikini, it's a bikini. Maybe that's what to think of. Are you laughing some more? Is that mm -hmm. something bikini we... <laughs> I oh, can smell something bikini. <laughs> bikini in what be? <laughs> oh, oh, look but, at me. No, but so what, what's what's it like? You know, you know. Um, mm. Do you uh, do you wear a bikini mm -hmm. and allowed? Are you in you know in your culture? Is it acceptable yeah. to? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. As yeah. as in Samoa, like like here here's the thing because. Okay, let, let me say this because, and I have to be really careful with what I said about yep. this in, in, in cultural meaning, because like in our, us Samoans, we don't really have a, um, this term's bikini in, mm. in terms of when we go swimming. Mm. We, we will use the terms of ofu ta'ele as, mm. in, as in general, lava yep. lava, because females, yeah, obviously will have short shorts inside mm -hmm. with a lava lava outside. Mm. Um, you know, they do nowadays, we've seen what we call sport bra, right? Yeah. yeah. Mm. But then, but then back in the, in the days, obviously a little t-shirt mm. for, for that's, that's what we, we, we used to have. Gotcha. Yeah. So that's why I'm saying when, when the old, you know, let's say the old man, Papa Stewie, when he said bikini, I'm pretty sure he wasn't meant to say that. He was yeah. meaning mini yeah. because... I mean, I, 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 we yeah, don't, I don't, we don't officially yeah. have a cultural, word, yeah. yeah. And I don't, and, and, and I'll be honest, like I, I, um, a lot of our Samoan women, and I think um, Claudia and I discussed it last mm. week as well. Um, Claudia did say, "Hey, I've never actually seen um, a Samoan girl wear a bikini." Mm. And you're right, you no. would never. With no shorts. Yeah. Um, no. And and I, the only time I've worn a bikini is when it's just been um, here in New Zealand, and mm. I have in in Nalumanu Beach. But um, I've been quite discreet. I go all the way down. <laughs> yeah. I go all the way down. Be, you have to, be, I just you have to be far, far away from the mini cameras. <laughs> so I'm just like looking, and if I don't see any salmons, um, the, the locals are like, if you're faking salmon, I'll be bikini, I'll be lost. You know, so it is, um, yeah. I am quite, you know, but um, I, you know, I was born in New Zealand, so, you know. It was, uh, and, and there's it, nothing like, to me. It was accepted, you know. It was acceptable. And, so. and look, Bea, I, I, I'm, I'm saying there's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong with that. <clears throat> I mean, I mean, because put it this way, our Samoa is is founded with a um, a strong fat Samoa mm -hmm. ways. Yeah, of course. Right. And and one of the ways that we we have in Samoa is the respect between a male and a female, mm. brothers yeah. and mm. sister. So obviously, you know, uh, when we see us as as brothers, when we see our sisters, and I know we don't we don't picture them, yeah, yeah. you know, in that kind of anti or yeah. or, or, or but mm. hey, born in New Zealand and 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 with the modernisation days nowadays, yeah. I mean, it comes to your free agencies to choose yeah. what's best yeah. for you, mm -hmm. and and you know, man, your man uh, is right there. There's no <laughs> other judge. Yep. Better than yep. his judgment yep. mm. and approval of saying that if it's okay with them, hey. I don't think crazy. it's okay with them now. <laughs> <laughs> not, now. <laughs> not now. I mean, we were saying, yeah. why not? Yeah, why not? Why is it not okay now? Um, <laughs> why not? Because he said I had to lose a little bit more weight. Oh. Like, <laughs> you did not. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> well, do you know what, fella? We have started going to Zumba, so yeah. come Sunma. Come summer, we'll be rocking that bikini um, there at Long Without the Long lava lovers. <laughs> there's, there's another saying, Lele Missy Ifopo, Ole Ofu Fa Ali Ali Ayo Bui Manava Mau Onga Vai. So in English, it's a dress or it's a wear mm. that shows your pelly 
part, yes. tummy, mm. and uh, your thighs, your legs. legs. Yes. Uh, but considering the fact that it's such a long translation. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> beginning is one word, and a salmon translation is about like a paragraph. Ten, but, you know, and I was like, two piece, that's it. Two uh, yeah, piece. Yeah, two piece. That's it. Oh, that's, that's a, a nice two one. Piece. Two, piece. two piece. Two piece. Mm. Yeah, a two piece suit. What piece? <laughs> or, or, I think you've got it. Or I, I, will, got I will always it. say this, in my own, in my own fasa mm. I will probably looking at Ofu... Of I found a lot of time, it will say, I'll just say, of mode. You know, goggles. You know how those swimming girls are yeah. in competition? Oh, the synchronized swimmer. <laughs> now we, we just use of mode way, probably that. You know, uh, probably. <laughs> See, you know, it should just be as easy as Spanish. Bikini, yeah. bikini. Yeah, bikini. Yeah, let's Look, say You know, bikini. um,. Oh, before you say something, I just want to say a shout out to Lelef. She is tuning in from, from Alaska. Alaska. Hello, and also hello to Sui, watching yeah. from Sydney. And uh, Flora, Flora, Fijia, Nemia. Can we just have a runway of bikini and swimsuits now? <laughs> <laughs> I firmly believe our women's are to be encouraged and empowered to be comfortable mm. and confident in themselves and their mm. bodies today. Uh, also today, a lot, a lot, lot of our, our young Pacifica women are having body insecurities because of our surroundings and people judging us. This is coming from someone who mm. had to overcome the stereotypes of being labeled as a big person uh, and struggle with body confidence and self-love. Be you yourself and allow yourself to love you first and in all you are. That's wow. Beautiful. Beautiful. Well done, nice. Laura. Well, I like that. I think you summed up mm. exactly yeah. the, you know, what we're trying yeah. to the message Great. we're trying to get across. I love that. Thank you love so much, it. Flora. Um, That's good. That's a very very honest yeah. uh, opinion. Yeah, I love the yeah. No, I love and we and we need yeah. this sort of uh, um, comment. Yeah, mm. opinions. So to then, show. Flora, when are you going to come on the show to do that <laughs> runway bikini show? Uh, can you give us a sample, please, <laughs> just yeah. you know how to start up and then you know. <laughs> well, I, I think I think by the end of this year, you can expect a bikini runway. I think I'm yeah. going to. We're gonna because um, we're gonna we're gonna yeah. zumba every. Can Saturday. I be the judge? Can I be the judge? No, no you you're, can't. Uh, you're participating. <laughs> You're going to have a man here. <laughs> and, and I think it's uh, I think it's important, you know, and I, and I understand that everyone's going to be, um, you know, probably my husband's going to turn his head and say, well, Now, Fala, will be, you're one of the judges. Fala, <laughs> you're one of the judges. I'm I, inviting I think, you on, um, online. Flora, you, you said it perfectly. Um, I love that. I love, um, really, really, really love your message that you've sent through. Um, but to everyone that's tuned in, that has sent me a comment through. TJ. No, TJ Letalie. Talofa uh, from Lefanga. I don't know where that is. Lefanga show. Probably Lefanga in Samoa. Yeah. If I'm going to go to my new go bikini. I saw the label local. I think if I'm going to go to my new go bikini. bikini on one of our shows. <laughs> but look, um, to all our ladies out there, um, and, uh, you know, just Flora perfectly she said. Mm, she mm. Really um, just be confident in what you are wearing. Um, Absolutely. You know, inner beauty is still is for me is still number one, mm -hmm. and you know, it does. It will always carry you through whatever you wear, and it doesn't matter what you wear if you put your whole heart into what you that's are it. doing. That's and it. guarantee that you will um, execute whatever it is, one hundred percent. Right? Like mum, that actually remind me what mum said to me when I was older. She's like, if you have an ugly personality and you treat people poorly. Then it doesn't matter if you wear labels or the best mm. brands, yeah. you're still gonna look ugly. Yeah. Absolutely, and, no. I, and I've, I've witnessed that. I've seen that myself because I used to do part-time securities, mm. and I've been looking at those corporate functions, eh, yeah. where you see this um, good-looking, you know, like massive, nice, yeah. holy, and then it comes to us and. You, 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 like all doing us, mm, giving us mm, all mm. this uh, yeah, yeah, as like, if we're mm, little yeah. kids, eh? mm. and then no mas uh, manners or whatsoever mm. to show. I thought to myself. You're too beautiful for that yeah. kind of attitude, mate. Yeah. Yeah, it's just not suits you. It is, and, and, and uh, with you know, we and like last week, um, and no, you know, you know, I, we did discuss um, the whole um, you know status kind of thing um, when that comes into play as well, and mm. what you dress and what you wear, and you know, it's, it's quite a, a 
messy kind of, but it's good to, that we're talking about it because, yeah. you know, some some of... And it's funny. It is funny. Imagine if we are in the mankini. <laughs> and now, my question is, because I just, I just I absolutely um, remember mm -hmm. this. So out of all, have you have you have you looked at all these commenting and whoever talks and uh, sort of uh, negative about our females? Mm. Have have you um, found out are they are they what what sort of um, sex are they like? Are they male perspective or are they female perspective See, as well? I feel like it's usually females mm. hating on females. Then then then, yeah, then I believe then I believe it's jealousy. You know, mm. I'm sorry to say that. I have to be quite mm. frank. I believe mm. it because no no the reason why I've asked that because. I'll, I'll, I'll feel very, very, dis, I mean, disgusting if, if this are coming from males, mm. you know, because, I mean, we should respect but females regardless. I would probably say that females are more vocal about yeah. it. Absolutely. But men also. Well, then, then if, yeah. if, 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 part, if they can't. Say, I'm sorry. Yeah. I mean, I mean, well, well, maybe, I maybe it's straight to come from a male then, you know, with saying this. Mm. No, I, I, and, and I purely said this, it's out of, you know, I'm not, I'm not, I'm pretty sure part mm -hmm. of it is, is that that mm. that pity jealousy and, yeah. and the, just because you can't wear it, just because you can't do it, mm. just because you you, mm. you your you know educations can't compare to you know honestly, I, and I'm being straight up because this sort of attitude, this sort of commenting should stop. Mm. Period. Mm. It should stop. Yeah. If you, you don't know, like it, do something. Absolutely. About it. Mm. So if you mm. feel unhappy about yourself, do something to make it. For example, happy. and you know, Pierre, we, we've we've mm. been talking. Uh, I mean, mm -hmm. off yep. off off the camera most yep. of the time in regarding uh, this mm. uh, announcing this mm. journalist. I mean, we, we're new. I'm new into the uh, um, uh, the uh, environment, mm. and I always talk, I, I talk highly of. Of the people that paved the way for us, yeah. Whether I like it, some people I don't like. I don't yeah. like personally, but yeah. hey, I never use in me. Yeah. And I've always talked highly of them, yeah. Yeah. specifically the achievement mm. in this environment. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what we need to do. Yeah. You know, yeah. if I can't be the CEO of the media right now. Talk highly of them because you never know. You're probably in the next 10, 20, 30 never plus know. years. Yeah. Oh, I, I, I totally, I definitely agree. And yeah. and that's and I've always been. Um, you know, a big believer um, with when you do something, you do it with your whole heart yeah, and absolutely. with kindness. Yeah. And I tell you, it will follow you. And even if someone has mistreated you, and that's where I'm going to go back to um, uh, the yes. quote, the Monday quote, because this does Eyes fall into what we're nice. talking about. Hey, hey, what's the Monday never, quote? Never seek revenge. Rotten fruit will fall by itself. And that's exactly what we were talking about. Mm. You know, um, don't seek revenge. Um, if someone has been negative towards you, um, just turn the other cheek um, and you'll you'll be all right. Yes. You know, eventually yes. you'll get there. Here's a funny <laughs> comment from TJ. A speedo show for man. Show the beauty of God's creation. <laughs> Thank you well so done, much for TJ. that, TJ. <laughs> yes, we agree. But um, yeah, no, nah, I think also, I think we had a bit of fun discussion. Yes. We had a fun yeah, discussion absolutely. today. So, guys, make sure that you are following and that you like the Blue TV um, Facebook page. Yeah. Because this is where you're going to find us Monday to Friday. 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 <laughs> Four to five. Like us on YouTube as well for more bikini <laughs> fun like <laughs> conversation. Look, we just, it was just an open conversation that we wanted to have here. Um, and that's, uh, you know, a safe space that we can do this. Um, tomorrow, tune in. We have um, the uh, For the Boys podcast. Uh, who, are, who will be here Three of the boys um, will be here To talk ab uh, about mental health um, And yeah. we'll be talking a little bit why did they get it, you know, get their podcast started? We're excited. I'm super, super excited to have the boys on. So tune in because we're going to have a good laugh tomorrow as well. Don't forget Asiata show right after this. And we're sending a lot of love to Lorenzo as well. Baby is um, not well. So we oh, love you, Bethe. So, yeah. <laughs> you, Lorenzo? Uh, it's okay. You should yeah. stay you know. And of course, <laughs> Fafetai Lover. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much to all of our Absolutely. amazing sponsors. Uh, without our sponsors, uh, we won't be able to have um, this platform to share uh, the stories of um, the Pacific. So yeah. We are going to wrap up now, but before we do, I just want to say a funny comment um, from Rhi, I believe. It says, I agree, Asiata, but please don't wear a bikini. <laughs> <laughs> so happy Monday, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in, and we'll see you again tomorrow. Yeah, oh, sorry, just wait, and a massive <laughs> shout out to um, Inu hey, from I'm, uh, Hawaii I'm going to well. discredit you. Hey, I'm going to discredit you. <laughs> God Bye, bless guys. everyone. We evening. love you. <laughs> Esquad, baby. Rex, J. Sands. Oh, say I'm a say you are complete to me, I get you. By the way, that
that you move in a way that you smile. But I you. Say, oh my Torima, baby, you be giving your hand, I'll take you anywhere. You give me something that I never had. Yeah. Cause you care but about to me and the family. Say, why you waiting for me to talk to you? Yeah. I'm gonna listen what you say. Uh. Yeah. Don't move out in a camera. Yeah. Wine, girl, that you wine, yeah. Say, come on, in and look the pipe, okay, love, say, ooh.